before we get on with things here this evening, a look at the two starting lineups we'll see featured tonight. Pee Wee Reese will stand in, trying to keep up the hot pace as he's well over 400 here to start the year. And this will be lined into center field, and they've got themselves their first hit of the ball game. The tag, and they'll get him at second, and with that, the side is retired. Pee Wee Reese will try it again. He was thrown out trying for a double his first time. And a fastball runs in a bit too close for comfort that time. You got to figure that that man right there would be more than happy to see this guy at the plate taking his swings with two out and nobody on all night long. And so with the guy on the mound. Ready now on one and one. No offer on that one. Two balls and a strike. And this is something we've seen a lot from him recently. He's worked his way into another good hitter's count. Yeah, it's not unrelated either. When you're going good at the plate, it usually means you're being selective and you're not getting yourself out. And when that happens, you'll find yourself in these kind of counts. Giancarlo Stanton. Giancarlo Stanton will dig in. He singled his first time around. 2-2 pitch on the way. And there he goes towards second. And now a pitch hit sharply on the ground. And this will stay inside the third base bag. A fair ball. Now the relay home. And the go-ahead runs in to score as they break the tie. It's 3-2. to two. And these guys hitting 3, 4, 5, they're the ones that are going to have to produce if these guys are going to have any chance of contending this year. He comes through here with a well-struck RBI double. Pee Wee Reese will step now in. Singled and came around to score his last time. Reese. First pitch on the way. Hard hit towards center. Base hit. The tag, and he is called out trying for two. Bad decision. Pee Wee Reese will come forward now in what could be an at-bat that goes a long way toward deciding this ball game. And they better be careful, too, because they haven't gotten him out yet, so this is no small task. Now here's the first pitch. And he gets under this one and, in fact, breaks his bat as this one's popped up. And he'll avoid the fragments out there to make the catch that ends the inning. One left for Miami. They're up three to two. Michael Tan will stand in for the fourth time now. Still looking for his first hit of the ball game. And he's not the only one either. This has been a great pitching performance so far. They've had these guys chasing their tails all game long. Stanton is there to put it away for route number one. Making a bid here to get on base is the potential tying run. But this ball just didn't want to drop for him and winds up finding the outfielder's glove. Here he comes on two and two. Now a swing and a ground ball. This should do it. Throw to first is going to be in time to take care of him. And the Marlins have taken the first two games of this series on the road as this one is over. Before we take our leave, time for a look at our final line score here. So a move for a pinch hitter as he'll come on to hit with runners at first and second and still only one out. Now some movement out in the Phillies' bullpen as a lefty and a right-hander start to loosen. Swing and a ground ball towards the hole. And that is into right field, a base hit. 
and add another game to his hit streak right there. He's up to 11 games in a row now. Pee-wee Reese will dig in, and he's got to be licking his chops as he has absolutely owned this guy in his career. Oh, this ball's laced, and it's going to get down into the right center field gap. Around third and being waved on home. And the run's going to come into score from second as they grab a 2 to nothing lead now. Already their second double of the ball game here in the first inning. He's not fooled too many guys out there to this point, that's for sure. Eduardo will stand in and he's been a tough out these past couple of weeks as you see the average there over the course of the last nine ball games. The batter, Pee Wee Reese will stand in an RBI double to his credit the first time around. Swing and a broken bat as this ball's hit on the ground and no chance on the throw here as he reaches first easily. You really can't overemphasize the presence of speed and the pressure it puts on a defense. I mean he's fooled on this pitch hits a simple little slow grounder but he's busting it out of the box and he winds up beating it out runner goes pitch outside the throw and it's far too late as he steals second with ease Pee-wee Reese will dig in. He singled his last time around. Second baseman, Pee-wee Reese. Now a swing and a bouncing ball toward the hole. And a backhanded reach at first, but he can't flag it down. Well, he'd had some high-stress innings here so far. It was looking like he turned a corner and was on his way to a much-needed one, two, three. But he's going to have to get in the stretch here after all. Eduardo Rios will step in, a ground out victim his last time. Ready now on one and one. Pitches a cold strike, the throw. It's up the ladder and the tag comes in too late, so he's in at second base here with two away. Cody Ashey will stand in now, and he'll likely have a look down to third to see if anything's up here with nobody out. Here comes Fernandez, 0-2. Grounded to third. This could be two. One there. Throw on to first. Won't be in time, so they just get the one there. Yeah, you know, a double play there was always going to be a stretch, and that's where you just take that force out at second get the lead runner and then say, you know what? Thank you very much. Pee Wee Reese will get us going now in the top half of the eighth. And that's cut on and missed 0-1. And, and this is a guy who will not get cheated up there, and he almost came out of his shoes on that one. Fouled straight back. And the pitch. And that's off his leg on the mound. And now, fortunately, they will get an out here. And with that play over now, time to check and see if our man is all right. You can really see him favoring that leg. And that is his plant leg, which is always a concern. But from the way he's acting out there, I think it looks like he's going to be OK to try and continue. Pee Wee Reese will stride in, grounded out his last time through. Reese. First pitch hack in here, and that's the first strike. Not a real good effort there. Now, it, it's one thing if it's a slider running away or something like that, but that pitch right there was never going to be a strike. Here it comes. 
and smart to lay off there as the fastball misses. It's one and two now. Well, I, I think that fastball is just for show there. He's not trying to throw this for a strike. And this is hit well towards the hole. And a good effort on the dive that time, but this will get by him for a base hit. Boy, these fans will be happy to see this guy leave town. That's for sure. He has absolutely eaten him up here in this series. He delivers again. Eduardo Rios will step in. One for four in the ball game. Three and two. Here it is. Swing and a liner. But this is going to get foul. Good battle here. This will be the seventh pitch coming up. Toby Sanchez will get another crack. One for three thus far. Barney Switzer will step in. An RBI single his last time around. Quite a lot of offense in this one, but if we had to highlight one guy that made the difference, there he is. He's our top player of the game. Inside the 